Jesus to me is someone who has changed my life. To me, he's like a friend, but most importantly to me, he's the truth. Therefore, I find that if he is really the truth, if he has given me meaning in my life, I should share this with others too. I think I shouldn't keep him to myself, I should share him with everyone. I didn't always stay with my dad, he left the family, but we would meet up every week, which was on Sunday. When I was very young as a toddler, my parents would bring me to Mass. Watching them go every week to, uh, to church inspired me to know more about the faith. It also kind of allowed me to, to feel the importance of Mass because it was the time where our family came together as a whole family. Now, with all these problems in my family, I was still sad. Yeah, I had faith problems, but in all these times, you know, Mom would tell me to pray. And I, I knew too that my dad was struggling and he was praying. And we prayed as a family every day. We had communities and church that supported us. You know. Eventually, my dad, he came back to us. He came with a very happy family. And my, my dad was always supportive of my faith journey too. In fact, I think he prays more than me now. When I was six years old, I joined the altar service. And that to me was one of the best decisions I made in my life. Being able to be close to the altar helped me to develop devotion to the Holy Eucharist. Helped me to better understand parts of the Mass. When I got into SCI, I joined the Legion of Mary, the altar service there as well. And all this helped to cultivate my faith. The teachers there were very supportive. They organised a lot of spiritual activities for us. These little things like the sacraments being made available to us in school was very important to me and helped me in my faith. I started live streaming, you know, because most of my friends had a YouTube channel, streaming games. And I did play games, but I don't play that much. So I thought, then what can I stream? Morning prayer was one of the most enjoyable things for me or something I look forward a lot to in SCI but when the pandemic came in you know, we had to stop morning prayer in fact we had home based learning when I was confined at home I started to realise that I wasn't that inspired during lessons it's hard to pray alone but with the community it's easier for me to pray I thought why don't we try to do it online let's live stream it so I expressed my thoughts with my friends. They agreed to help me and together we set it up with the permission of the teachers and soon we could pray as a school community every day. The response was quite good. Many people attended the morning prayers. Even students who would not normally attend attended because perhaps it's easier online for them. Many of my friends who were not active also came forward to help us with a live stream. Slowly we started having school masters again for the whole school. My love and interest actually helps to inspire me in my faith as well because through media, through technology, social media, I learn more about the faith, I get inspired from there. Technology is something that all the young people are affected to. It is something that everyone understands and relates to a lot. And through this too, I feel it's easier for me to spread the word of God, to constantly try to live our lives in the service of others. Let us participate in this historic celebration to ignite and shine with faith in all that we do. For more information, scan the QR code or visit catholic200.sg.